going on guys it's your boy the iguana man we're back at you guys with another video we have my brother chris up, from man? the cno family in the building now guys you guys heard about the lockdown there's a bunch of crazy stuff going on here in Every, florida everything's on lockdown bro there's no food at stores there's nothing there's no paper there's no water there's nothing guys you had you were at the bank earlier you had to wait like three hours right you only let 10 people in per, per bank bro 10 people in per bank per day that's absolutely insane then we went to walmart today thinking we're gonna go get a couple of things of water guess what there's a line to go in walmart only 10 customers are allowed in walmart too there's like a two block line outside so i don't i don't honestly know what's really going on i mean we're seeing this thing progress really fast and at the rate that it's going these stores and these banks might be closed these there's stores not, there's not gonna be full either bro. these close these stores and banks might be shut down in the next couple weeks not week probably days there's not gonna be food right yeah. so me and chris from the cnl family just came up with the most genius idea while all you guys are going to be not having food or relying on the stock pod that you guys have me and chris are going to be prospecting for new places where we can fish and hunt animals for meat and stock up on you want, right? exactly <laughs> so guys we are over here at this new territory that we have permission to hunt, control the iguanas, but it's a win-win because we're doing pest control, but we're also filling the freezer up with food. Let's stack up the refrigerator, bro. How are we going to be catching these guys today? I have a surprise for you, bro. Yeah? Yeah. Well, first, we're going to be using the gamble. A gamble swarm whisper. Oh. A clip of 10 rounds in here. Uh, I think it's a whisper swarm, and yeah, swarm they say whisper. it's got 10 shots. Does this have 10 shots? Clip right here. It has 90 here right now, but. Put oh. Here. Dang, this is the gun that I really need to get for my business. It's probably gonna be impossible to get one of these guns because all the stores are shut down. But dude, Go guys, away, look at this thing. You, bro. Look you. at this thing. So thanks, bro. So we're gonna be able to use this gun today, huh? I got, I got, I got a surprise, bro. Not the surprise. It's not the surprise, what? bro. He's got a surprise? And I went to Walmart. Oh! oh! To buy it. <laughs> yeah? This, hold on. Oh my god. Bro, you got me a gun? Holy smokes. You're not playing with me, are you? No, it's yours. Brand new. Oh, look. Brand new in the package. You got your own clip right here. Oh, it's got a clip and it's got a scope. It's got a scoop. Oh. Right now, how to sight it yeah. in. <laughs> Bro, you're going to teach me you're going to teach me one's a fat lesson with this one. Oh my gosh, guys. Chris from the CNO family just got me my very own Gamo 22 Swarm with the with the scope, with the scope, and with the 10 round clip. Check that bad boy out, dang, bro! I really appreciate it, dog. I really appreciate it, guys. If you guys haven't already, go check out Chris from the CNO family, guys, for putting us on this spot and also donating this gun to help all of to help us. Teach these iguanas a fat lesson. Bro, you know what safety is, right? Safety orange, I'm guessing, right? Yep. Got to put that safety tip, y'all. You going to put it on? Go ahead, man. So why is it important to have this orange, just for the viewers at home? Because you say a cop puts up to you, they're going to think this is a real gun without that thing, bro. Yeah, OK. Sweet. Look at this. this is... Now it looks way different, though. Yeah, for real. Now it looks, yeah, looks, looks sweet. Now we got to put this scope on? Or the clip. All right. And the scope, do you just put it on and it's good to go? You have to calibrate it. Yeah? Is that yeah, hard? It's going to be like 10 shots and it's good. Okay. We can do that out on the field, I guess, right? Yeah. You can test it out on the one and see where it hits. Sweet. So, guys, we at the place looking for some iguanas. Iguana. Right, Letty? Yeah, right. What are we looking for? Iguana. Kill him? Yeah. Look at this little girl. I haven't seen. Oh, it's a big one over on the other side, babe. Oh, I found it. Guys, stay wait, tuned wait, to see what we get. We're going to be using air rifles hey, babe, for the whole video. Babe, babe. Huh? Where's your watermelon? You over there. Oh, I found it. Look at bro. These are burrowing owls, bro. They're protected species. You see how, oh. like, right outside there? Yeah. They're miniature owls, bro. And they they're so little. Yeah. They live underground, bro. And there were two more over there. You seen them? Yeah, yeah. They're saying that iguanas are going inside their nest. Because you've seen an iguana nest before, right? They're the same thing. Same exact thing, bro. 
Oh. So these are these are protected species out here. And you know, an iguana sees this hole. It just looks just an iguana hole, bro. Yeah, you might just go right into it. And look, you could see like you can see scats from things they've eaten, bro. Look at that. Holy all this is fur from animals and stuff. You see that fur and bones and but yeah, we're, we're these things actually they actually attack too, bro. They attack? Yeah, they have they have babies that are like this big. One time, I, I, they look. Yeah, those are the adults. Yeah. Those are the adults? Yeah, they have baby ones. Baby. Those are the baby ones. <laughs> yeah, guys, like we said, we are just prospecting new areas for food. Thank you. Uh, we're stuck in that iguana meat. Yeah, we got to, man. We got to. That's free food. It's Everyone should be doing that right now. There's no food at Walmart. Hey, yeah, ju and just now it's gonna. Psh, trust me, bro. Chris, mic'd up. Chris, you mic'd up, bro. Hey. Yeah, bro. Mic'd up, mic'd up, mic'd up. Oh. oh. You see, brother, bro? Got him. Oh, first one. Got him. You domed him in the eyeball. Domed him. <laughs> Guys, this is how we do it. Yo, this domed is him. crazy. <laughs> Told you, bro, that guy was just the, the job done. Dang, you want to hit KO. <laughs> Bro, he's right there. One shot, guys. Straight to the sweet spot. Put the lizard down humane. That's it. This is a big lizard right here, bro. One shot to him, right? Big, yeah, big lizard right here, bro. Huge. I didn't even see him. Look at the video of the little one from that way. And this one was right here. Yeah, yeah, right there. We didn't see him. We were chasing a female, but we ended up getting a bigger male. And this is gonna, this is a big lizard. This is gonna feed. A lot of people right here. Right there, this bro. is a, a such a blessing right here to be out here, guys, and hunting our very own meat. Look at that, sweet. But the guy must swung, guys. Just one shot. You don't need no PCP. I don't need that. It's too extreme. These are just iguanas. You know what I'm saying? There's two right there, bro. Yeah. Ooh. Got one. Yeah. Oh, nice. One hit kill again, bro. Dang, this one. Where? Yeah. For what? Anybody armed? Anybody have a pellet gun? A pellet gun, yeah. A pellet gun's over there. Yeah. So you guys know why I'm here, right? They see a bunch of guys running around carrying a gun, and guess what? They call the police. Okay, yeah. Okay, you see a problem with that? Yeah. Yeah. You guys live over here? In, in uh, Sunrise. In Sunrise? Okay, so you don't live on 24th Court here. You have a reason to be back here. You're just hunting iguanas. Okay, so you're hunting iguanas. Okay. I didn't know it. ID? We all have. Yeah. Please. Yeah, so we didn't know, sir. All right. We, well, we, I mean, our fellow's going to have an orange tip. In the future, what should we do next time? You guys should be at home. Everyone should be at home. Social distance. There's a stay I go hunt iguana order. There's no food. Trying to get our own We're food. Trying to get some food. Iguanas are basically speed. Go to Publix. They have food. They have food there. I was just there. Just a big ass line. So we're like, we might as well go see if we can get an iguana for lunch. You guys think that standing here on a major roadway with a rifle in your hand is the right thing to do? Because I saw you when I drove by. Okay, we had the orange tip on it. We didn't know if yeah, it was obviously when it was done. Yeah, we yeah. people would have found out. There's no... We're not shooting at no people. Nobody said you were shooting at people. I never said you were shooting at people. Okay. I mean, there's people, there's people riding dirt bikes over here all the time, though. They're not with a rifle in their hand. You understand the difference? Well, our, our rifle has an orange tip on it. We're doing the right, correct way. Anything with orange. Yep. Yeah. Who else has ID? 
Yeah. You have your idea? Is it is in there too? No. Oh. Were you running to chase after the iguanas? Yes. Probably, yeah. Uh, Wait, well, you, you didn't run to chase them. We, no, we're, we, just, we're just hunting them. We're just we, following them and we're shooting them down, just recording them. Yeah, we're just. At any point, did you guys run? I ran with this camera to get the close, closer so footage. The way the call came out is males are running around, one's chasing one with a rifle. Yeah, me with the camera. Well, that's not how the thing came out with the camera, but with the rifle. <laughs> No, um, no, he, I, I run up. Oh. When, when people see stuff, they call the police. This is the information that, that's the only information we get. Yeah. Is what whoever calls the police and says. Yeah, that was me, right? <laughs> I know that's yours. That is. Sweet. That's yours. Um, next time, I mean, short of the running around, chasing, look what appears to be someone chasing somebody with a rifle. You guys are just out here fishing or something like that. We don't come out and we don't give people a hard time. The only time you ever come out here is when they fall. Well, not not them, but okay. when the residents are <laughs> <don't know. laughs> right here. Yeah, yeah. No, no, we don't. Um, but, but I guess next time, hypothetically, if we ever were going to hunt with air rifles, we'll just probably just stay in the car or just put it. If you guys go out with fishing poles and you have it next to you on the ground, and oh, look, there's an iguana, you pick yeah. it up and pop it. Yeah. And... That's fine. Then. So maybe hypothetically, in a, in a, <laughs> maybe yeah, sit in a down scenario and, like that. Maybe sit down and take your shot so you're not so threatening standing in True, around. true, true. Alright. Alright, guys. Alright, all right. Right. thank you. Huh? Did you think you should take a Go. Crazy, guys. These neighbors out here are tripping. You know what it is? They're hating that we're getting food. They don't want to see us eat. That's okay, though, because there's plenty of iguanas, plenty of other places for us to go with the Canal. Canal, bro. Same Donny Canal, y'all.